All right, all right, Shalom out there to the hopeful elect of the nation of Israel, the elect of Yahweh Shai. Kal Halayim, Wahawa Adla, Abanawa Yahawa, Bahashem Hamashiach, Wamalak Yahweh Shai, Wahabaha Racha Kodash. Double honor to the venerable apostles of the great millstone GMS who rule and teach our nation well today, leading the flock by example. Enough respect, peace, blessings. To the Bayas Dawadah, that is the house of David being built up and raised up in the latter days by Bible prophecy. The brothers pushing this gospel throughout the four corners of the earth in sincerity and in truth. Shalom to you. Adawan Raza, which means Lord willing. You know, it's so Lord willing, this lesson is edifying and, you know, it's nothing new. Okay. You know, these devils are just pushing out their, their wickedness again. Alright. Their decrees, their unrighteous decrees. Okay. You know, targeting the young. Alright. And you know, they've been doing this ever since the whole, you know, scamdemic started in 2020. Alright. But, you know, there's <clears throat> nothing new under the sun. Alright. So uh, this is from End Time Headlines, and the head article reads. The CDC has just added crown maxine to routine immunization schedule for kids and adults dated February the 10th, 2023. Hopeful year that all prophecies come to pass. Okay. It says C19 maxines are now included among the routine gunshots. Okay, I've got to be like that because, you know, algorithm, I don't want to throw it off. You know, and that, just, that proves that we're coming out with the truth. Okay, that you have to be mindful of, you know, how you how you articulate yourself. Okay, because these devils, man, they know the time is short. You saw Eden, so called white man. All right, he wants his new world order. Okay. So it says, C19 vaccines are now included among the routine shots recommended by the centers for, you know what, for children, adolescents, adults. The 2023 list includes orange juice for the particular diseases right, and other inoculations. The vaccine schedule represents the current recommendations for people as a regular part of their vaccinations against common illnesses. It does not mean that the uh, that particular centre is requiring a C19 orange shot. For children or that schools will have to require that students receive the orange juice shot before enrolling. The vaccine schedule is an important resource for physicians, especially paediatricians, that can help guide them on what is best to administer certain vaccines. The particular centre does not have the authority to mandate them. That decision is left up to states and local jurisdictions. Alright. You know, man, these, these aren't your true <coughs> your physicians. You know, just so, so I get that. In fact, before I get that, I'll get a uh, Proverbs chapter uh, 14 and verse 2. Okay. So you know who the wicked is. <clears throat> Proverbs chapter 14 and verse 2. He that walketh in his uprightness feareth the Lord Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, but he that is perverse in his ways despise him, right? You know, and Esau Edom is perverse by nature. He does despise the Most High. He has his own God complex that he wants to be the Most High. Okay? And he does not uplift, not push out the law, statutes, and commandments of the Holy Scriptures, the Bible. Okay? Let's get another precept. Oh, I'll just do this. Where is it now? Uh, That's right, it's the book of Job, chapter 13, verse 4. But you are forgers of lies. You are physicians of no value. Right? And, you know, they've been <coughs> administering these orange juice shots for, you know, rapidly. Okay, okay. And, you know, this ain't medical misinformation, but if you know anything about things like uh, developing certain uh, vaccines, Alright, these things take years to research, develop, manufacture, things of that nature. Alright, it's not something that's done in 
10 months. All right? And you know, real health. Okay? How you get real health is from the herbs. Okay? All right? Ginger, things like that. All right? And information's coming out, man. People are just they're falling over. Left, right, and center. Okay? Limbs not working, things like that. Not functioning neurologically. All right? This is Isaiah chapter 10 verse 1, woe, which is an old English word meaning misery, death, destruction, okay, woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that right grievousness which they have prescribed, okay, and this is one of them, and he's been doing many, many, that's why it's imperative that you so called blacks, Hispanics and Native Americans alongside the speckled birds, right, they're the children of Israel, okay, salvation is only open for you, okay, that's why it's imperative to repent and repent. Okay, stop trusting in the shadow of Egypt, stop going to Esau, Edom for for advice, for counsel, when you should be taking counsel of Yahweh, why Yahweh shy, okay, because if you continue to trust in this devil, man, you're going to falter, okay, and that'll be to your own detriment, your own downfall, alright, so if we get some more on that article, so the quick quick lessons to the spin power yeah, bashing our shy lord with me. So it says uh, for example, the flu thing has long been on the schedule of recommended childhood immunizations, but hardly any state actually mandates it for public schools. Under the new guidelines, healthy children six months to four years old should receive a primary stage of two, you know, orange juice shots, either the that or that, followed by a third of a bivalent Maxine, alright, so look at that, targeting the youth, okay, yeah, and this, this is just wickedness, pure wickedness, you, your own body, immune system, okay, is your natural, that's what Yahweh Bashing Yashai gave you, is your natural defense me uh, mechanisms to ward off any diseases, infections, right, you have your white blood cells, that, right, that helps with all that, but no, he wants to, you know, this devil wants to stamp away at you like that. And then soon he's going to come in with the charagma. Right, to make that mandated. Alright. Which is the RFID micro C hip. Okay, contrary to what some of these other Israelite groups are saying. These pseudo Israelite groups. Okay. And you must not take it. So children 5 to 11 years old should receive two orange juice shots of the you know what. Okay. And that's pretty much it on there. Okay. Um, you know, you're not supposed to have no cut in your flesh. Alright. Yeah, that's actually against the law. And you, you really, at this point in the stage, especially if you have children, man, you, you want to withdraw them from, from these schools. Okay, because look, you know, they're pushing this on the, on the children. Alright, and that's it's pure wickedness. This is uh, Leviticus chapter 19 verse 28. You shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am Yahweh. Okay. So you're not supposed to you know, get a needle inserted into your, into your flesh, into your body. Okay. No, you're supposed to have any tattoos upon you. Okay. And tattoos are heathenistic. Alright, so. Hey, you know, stick to... <coughs> You know, using olive oil and turmeric and things like that. Right, if you're coming down with anything. Alright. You know, this this ain't new. This is just, I'm more like singing to the choir. But if you're new to this, if you've not already done so, right, as a Hebrew Israelite from your perspective tribe, alright, or if this message resonates with you, repent because the kingdom of your Yahweh Shem Yahweh is at hand. So with that, I'll leave it there. Shalom. Till next time, Lord willing, Adam and Razar. Yeah. Pray for one another, pray for the apostles. Kwam Yasharala, Wa Ababa Ball, Shalom, Shalom to the elect.